Hi everybody, welcome back. In today's video, we're gonna do a quick and simple InDesign tutorial on their brand new feature that just came out this year called the Intelligent Subject Detection. It allows you to effortlessly wrap text around a subject or an object in an image, uh, just using just a few simple clicks and text wrap. So as you can see, I've got a spread here set up and in InDesign, uh, two columns on an eight and a half by 11 uh, facing pages here. Each column feeds into the next. And on our image here, we have a full bleed picture of a woman and as you can see, some of the text is overlapping on uh, on the image. So some of that text is, is illegible. So we want to take that text and wrap it around the uh, subject. And instead of manually doing this, InDesign has created this brand new feature that saves a ton of time. So in order to begin, go ahead and select the image that you want to apply the uh, text wrap to, and then select the text wrap button here with the circle in the middle. Wrap object around shape. So after you click that, you'll want to open up the control panel. So if you hold down option and then click that again, you'll get a, uh, a list of options here, or you can go to the window, text wrap, and it'll open it that way as well. So under the contour options, you should see a type. Go ahead and select this drop down, and then select select subject. So that'll give it some time, and then as you can see, the, it outlined our subject there just uh, based off the contrast of the image. And that is super handy and awesome. So if you want to adjust how closely the text is to the image that you're wrapping, if you go to the top of the text wrap box here, you can control that distance here. So if you go up, as you can see, it's adding a little shape around our existing shape. And that pretty much just controls how close the text is to the image you're wrapping to. So as you can see in our image, we've, we have a little bit of a problem as uh, our text needs somewhere to go. So in order to solve this problem, I think I'll just go ahead and shrink the image to better fit our layout. As you can see, we have a little weirdness happening here. So you can actually adjust how the text wraps. You can just say just to the left side, and that'll move all the text from uh, inside this bounding box to the outside. And as you can see, you can still move around the image and it'll still retain that same bounding box. So that's super handy and allows you to make little micro adjustments as you, as you need there. It's just a few simple clicks and you save so much time and energy and effort, and you're able to have this kind of end result here that looks really nice. If you got any value in this video, be sure to like, subscribe, and leave a comment down below with any other questions you may have in regards to InDesign or anything else that you would like to see featured on this channel. As always, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.